Hey guys, welcome to my animated DVD update in which I have Casper the Friendly Ghost. This one, I finally pulled the trigger on this one. This was in my wish list for the longest time on Amazon. Got the thin pack. Yeah, I wasn't even sure if they even still made a th the thin pack, but I mean, that's the one I wanted. So, yep, 20 bucks, that's well worth it. Next, next we have is Casper's Halloween Special. Yep, I know it's nowhere near Halloween right now, but got to get this also down here. We got the Thanksgiving that almost wasn't by Hannah Barbera. Did I show that too too quickly? Let me get down here and closer look at that still. The Thanksgiving that almost wasn't. Next up we have a fan-made copy I found on eBay. The Adventures of Superboy from 1966. Happy with that one as well. Next we got Wonder Woman. Now, I already have this uh, movie, but I don't have it with the figure. And I collect these figures, or this DVD with the figures. How to get this, that's where I bought it from, Half Price Books with the price. That's what I paid, $12.49. Very happy with that one. For for my Disney collection, The Adventures of Gummy Bears, Volume 1, which is Seasons 1, 2, and 3. They never made a Volume 2, which, if they did, should have been Season 4, 5, and 6. But they never did. Uh, this is the Thin Pack one. Next, we have Fraggle Rock with the slip cover. Slightly embossed as well. I used to watch this when I was a kid. I watched this one with my sister and brother. Yeah, I almost forgot to, I was watching this with my uh, sister, and she, she she was the one talking about that one. This one, I just, I watched that one when I was a kid, but just with my brother. Sister never watched Gummy Bears. Next up, we have Futurama Volume 5. Anytime you see this price, that's where I bought it from, Half Price Books. That, that would be the price I paid for it. So, Futurama Volume 5, Volume 6, Volume 7. I did get Volume 8, but that, can, that can't be in this update. That, that's going to have to be in my next animated DVD update. I got Volume 8 on uh, Blu-ray, so that will be in my next update. Next, we have Futurama's Bender's Big Score. I like that lenticular cover there. It's pretty cool. And then we have the beast with a billion backs. And then Garfield Halloween Adventure. And this one here is Garfield and Friends Season 3, which I, I didn't know they made this one. Season 3, I have Season 1 and 2 already, but uh, I came upon Season 3 accidentally on Amazon, and then when I've seen it, I immediately put it into my cart, and of course I had to get the, uh, since I was getting that, might as well get that, put it in my cart to get, get them both on, on the same day. The real, the real Ghostbusters, uh... They didn't make a complete series set, but it's way too expensive right now. If you can even find a legitimate copy of the complete series, you're looking at a whole lot of money. But this is probably the second best one to get, unless you unless you find a fan-made copy. Um, Sleeve Media does make them. But uh, this is the official one with 100 episodes. I probably don't even need to talk about that one. A lot of people have that one anyway. The Heathcliff and Dingbat Show. With Dingbat and the Creeps. The first steal. Has Dingbat and the Creeps. My light's kind of blurring it out. But yeah. Finally got that one. That's been on my wish list for several years as well. Here's a fan made copy of Ultra Force. This goes into my Marvel collection. It's finally got Ultra Force. And I know I got two um, 
fan-made copies, um, two fan-made uh, DVDs in this collection, which is Ultra Force and Superboy. Both came from eBay, but different sellers on eBay. For my Looney Tunes collection, we got Duck... I almost said Duck Tiles. We got Duck Dodgers Season 3. And my girlfriend bought me this one. And my girlfriend bought me this one the same day. The third season of Tasmania, which now I'm confused. I'll tell you in a minute. But uh, I have... Well, now I have the third season. And down here, I, it's just one shelf down. We have Tasmania season... Season 1, Part 1. And Season 1, Part 2. And for the life of me, I cannot find a second season. I don't know what's going on, but... I don't even think they made a second season on DVD. But I got season one and season three. Season one's broken up into two different DVDs. But the second season, I don't think they made it. Next up, the peanut, the Peanuts movie. And that's the price I paid for it. $5.99. And it was actually brand spanking new. Never even opened. I opened it. Comes with a slip cover too. But I opened it and I gave the code to my brother. And the code works too. So. It's not a bad price for six books. Return to the Planet of the Apes. This is one of the greatest. Uh, movie franchises. Of all time. In my opinion. But I never seen the filmation. Show. The animated show. So that would be something new for me. A new Planet of the Apes that I've never seen before. Tiny Heroes. I found this one from an old friend that I met up with. And uh, this is the sequel to uh, The Seventh Brother. So the, the Seventh Brother, I believe, is the early 90s. This is 97, I think. So approximately about five or six years apart from the sequels. And then... Finally found the eighth season of The Simpsons. I've been looking for this one, not the face one, but I wanted this one here. Finally got that one. And the tenth season of The Simpsons. This one came from Amazon, Spawn. Uh, when this originally came out, it was a, a ten case. This is just a plastic, clear plastic case, which I'm alright with because I waited so long to get it. So, I mean, I like that show anyways. I watched it when it was on HBO way back in the 90s. I used to collect the comic books as well and figures. I was a big fan of Spawn. Next up we have is Stripperella, Stan Lee's Stripperella. Thin pack collection. Actually, I think they're all thin packs, but I'm not sure. And then we have, we have the Swan Princess, and this is part one. And then we, we have part three, the Mystery of the Enchanted Treasures, but we don't have part two. We, I mean, why would they put part one and three in here? At least they come in separate cases, too. Nice. But yeah, they have part one and part three. That's where I found it at. Part one and part three, but part two is not in here. And then we have the glow in the dark, the Halloween glow in the dark, Woody Woodpecker with the slip cover. Well, of course it's the slip cover. Let's see if I can see the case, get the case out. I'm trying to do this with one hand. But that is, that's it right there. And that is all I have for this update. Yeah, and here's what I was talking about, the, the Tasmanias. So this is Season 1, Part 1, Season 1, Part 2, and Season 3. But in between 
should be a season two and there's nothing here. So uh, maybe one day if they decide to release it, we'll get it. And maybe it's already le released and I overlooked it. I don't know. Just in case you're wondering what the spines would look like, um, season three does look a little different than the first season. So there's that. Here we got Doc, Dodger, Doc Dodgers. We got season one, season two, and season three. So they did this one correctly. Got all three seasons on DVD of Doc Dodgers. And here's what the spines look like. So, um, they match a little bit, but not quite. So yeah, they're, I mean, season one and two match perfectly with the lettering and everything. This is the season all the way up here. The lettering's all the way up here. But can't complain. Nitpicking. At least we got it. I just wish they released season two of the Sylvester and Tweety Mysteries. We only got season one. Never ever season two released. And I'm looking forward to this one. If they ever do make it, I'll probably buy it by uh, day one. Here's two... Two transfers, two different transfers of Ultra Force. Got me a sleeve media copy. And I got me this uh, one here. But this one was really expensive on eBay. It was 40 bucks um, with tax. It's, uh, what is it, 42 and some change. I forget. This one's the cheaper one. I like sleeve media, but this one's better. And I got this from, in case you want to know, I got this one from an eBay seller named... His eBay name is Donsner, so you guys can look this up. Donsner, if you're if you're interested, it's forty bucks from him. And here is all three seasons that they put out on uh, DVD as of lately. I know I know they made the old box sets, but this is the, these are the new ones. So finally, adding season three to the collection. So you guys know what the spines look like. There it is there. And that's it. Thanks for watching guys.